Soon I'm climbing all four walls in my apartment. I can't spend another second with my brain. Hey, what up, good people? It's me, Miss Ebony V. Welcome back or to my channel. If this is your first time here, thanks so much for joining me today. I do hope you'll consider hitting that subscribe button as well as that notification bell so you don't miss any other videos from me. And if you're returning, hey, Shook Muffin, thanks for rocking with your girl. So if you've been rocking with me, you know that I've kind of been away for a couple weeks, maybe a few weeks at this point, but I am so glad and so excited to be back in front of this camera. Who knew that I would miss <laughs> recording and chit-chatting with my family? Oh my God, I miss y'all so, so much. I never thought I'd be here. <laughs> I'm like, oh my God, I got, it's like an itch. Like, oh my God, I gotta record. <laughs> That's how I've been feeling. Oh, I just want to take a moment to just, Thank y'all, just thank you, thank you, thank you for your patience and support while I have been away taking care of home, y'all. On a positive note, I have moved into my nice new home, which I am super thrilled about. This is not my normal recording area. However, I had to find a temporary location until I can get through all of these boxes I'm swimming in y'all oh my god moving is a monster it is the whole devil until you get to the rainbow on the other side almost there not quite all the way but I'm getting there y'all I'm getting there jeez this is a lot of work I haven't moved in like seven years and now I see why I was paying ridiculously high rent in the DMV area. I'm going to be transparent. I'm going to be blunt and transparent and tell you why I had to move because it was just stupid what I was paying. I was paying like, okay, let's just say I was paying over $3,000 a month just on rent. Not including any other bills, no utilities, no no cable, no nothing, nothing. Just on rent over three thousand dollars. Like this, is just stupid. I was just like, why am I doing this to myself? I don't even own this house. If I can provide a word of wisdom, if you're able and capable, buy your own house. Can you hear me? Buy your own home if you're able and capable. Stop with this rent foolishness because it is such a waste and a drainage and you have nothing to show for it. It's not even yours. You're just throwing money into someone else's home. Stop. Now granted, this, again, like I mentioned before, is my second home. I have another home that I purchased before that I actually lived in. I moved and it is now rental property. So, this is now going to be the finale home for quite some time. And I'm super excited. So, I, whew, I highly encourage you to purchase your own home. If you don't own now, buy. It's not a buyer's market though, y'all. I'm going to be real. It's not a buyer's market unfortunately well wait till that buyer's market come back around and then buy buy all i feel like i have put so much money into renting a home that was not mine I, i'm at this point i bought it as much as i put into it i've purchased it so to speak you know what i mean just buy your own and let it be yours, okay? I just have to say that. We have to help each other in our own community. Purchase your own home, okay? All right. On another note, as soon as I moved into my home, my poor husband took ill. It was like a week and a half after moving in. Yeah, so I have been caring for and taking care of him 
in the process. We thought he had a stroke. Praise God. That's not what it was. Whew. So I've been by his bedside the whole way through. And he has recovered tremendously. And all I can do is thank God for that. I mean, it is like a whole recovery. Going from not speaking, not understanding what is being said, not walking, not eating, all of that happened and just completely turned around in a matter of like 48 hours. Praise God. That is my testimony. Like God is real. I am faithful. I am a believer. I love my God. Okay. So I truly appreciate all of the heartfelt and kind words that were sent to me through messages. I'm so grateful for you all. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for your prayers and support. God bless you all. I thank you. Thank you so, so much. I mean, it's been a struggle. And those encouraging words were definitely helpful and got me through this trying time. My husband as well. All right, y'all. So it is Monday and I have yet another human hair slay on a Monday, which I have not done. It feels like in forever. Maybe about a month it feels like. Oh, I just thank God I'm back. I just thank God I'm here. It just feels like so much time has passed. And just so you know, all my wig bays, the faithful wig bays that are like always here, just, just know and believe I will be there to support your channel and catch up. I know I have a lot of catching up to do, so bear with your girl, but I will catch up. All right, so today I'm going to be reviewing this Brazilian straight human hair headband wig from Abiel Hair. I hope I'm saying that right. Huge shout out to them for sending me this wig and sponsoring this video. I also want to say thank you for your patience as I got through my own personal emergencies. I know I was supposed to get this out a long time ago. So thank you, thank you, thank you for your patience. I truly appreciate it. And thank you for sending me this hair. All right, so let's just go ahead and dive right into the unboxing, styling, and review of this wig. All right, y'all, here is the unpackaging of this wig, and they were kind enough to include some goodies like this wig cap, some makeup brushes, this nice headband, and a care card. And this is what the beautiful hair looks like straight out of the package, very soft. Just like most headband wigs, this one comes with the headband already attached and it does have the Velcro attachment in the back. For the cap construction, you do get the two combs on the sides, one in the middle, one in the back and your adjustable straps. A lot of times it's easier to just clip the hair out of the way so that you can attach the Velcro in the back and the hair don't get all stuck in it. Don't mind my little kitchen back here, y'all. It's been a rough few weeks. If you suffer with any kind of alopecia or hair loss around your edges, you can definitely pull the headband all the way forward. Um, but my, for my personal preference, I do like to fold my headband back um, and, you know, have some of my edges hanging out. Now this hair does give a nice natural looking feel. However, it is a little thin for me. Can't you see that I need company? I'm losing it, losing my way. So I decided to go in with my flat iron and curl it a little bit just to give it, you know, just a little more volume. Let me fix my mistakes. You could be here right now. Lay here by my side.
right, y'all. So, what do you think about this one right here? I think it's super cute. I think the hair is very nice and soft. It curls well. They provided a nice, super cute headband with it. One headband, which is okay. That's totally fine. And I'm actually, for the most part, quite pleased with this wig. I have not experienced any tangling nor shedding with this wig. Okay, I won't say no shedding. Okay, there's been like a strand here and there. No big deal. So that's like minimal to no shedding. No big deal. I can live with that. Now, one of the major cons for me whew, is the super light density. The density is actually unknown on this wig. I did not see it in the packaging. I did not see it on the website. I don't know what the density is, but if I had to guess, I would say 130, maybe 150 might be pushing it, but it's not a lot of density in this hair. And that's why I decided to go ahead and curl it to make it appear like more density, but it's super thin. However, now with that, it's super affordable at the same time. So I have mine in 14 inches and that is a whopping $46.99. Like for that price, your expectations can't be way up here. <laughs> I mean, no lie. For that price, your expectations got to stay down here a little bit. Like, that is a phenomenal price. Under $50 for a human hair headband wig? Like, they've done all the work for you. The headband is already attached. You just throw in a nice little cute one on top of it. For under $50 for human hair, y'all. You have to know and understand what you're paying for. Now, you can also get this wig all the way up. To 26 inches and that will run you only $104.99. I feel like that is super affordable for 26 inches. That's a lot of inches for $105. Now granted, you might not get a whole lot of density if you decide to keep it straight, but I feel like curling it up or crimping it or whatever, doing some kind of additional styling would definitely help it look or appear more full and with a lot more density, for sure. Now with this wig, you also have the option of choosing a different color of 1B slash 99J. Now for those who watch me all the time, you know I'm here for a good 99J hair color, so I'm sure that is just as beautiful. Now the prices do vary a little bit differently with choosing that hair color based on the length you decide to get. So as always, I'll be sure to leave all of the necessary links down in the description box below. So feel free to check it out. If I failed to mention it before, this wig can be found on my favorite shopping location. Amazon, yes, you can get this on Amazon. As always, I'll include my link for any other wigs that I may be selling, as well as any other headband wigs that I have reviewed on my YouTube channel. So feel free to check those out as well. All right, so that's really all that I have on this beautiful headband wig, y'all. Huge shout out again and thank you to Abiel Hair on Amazon for sending me this wig and sponsoring this video. Truly appreciate it. Thank you. Huge shout out to you all for watching this video. Thank you. Thank you. If you have made it this far in the video, please be sure to leave me a nice little sunflower here down into the comments below so that I know you made it to the end of the video. Thank you all so, so much for watching this video. I truly, truly appreciate it as always. Please be sure to thumbs up this video, hit that subscribe button if you have not, and I'll be sure to catch you lovely people in my next video.